Because obviously you're fighting with our people for ties and stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Um, one more point. The uh, the work. Okay. Sorry, Harry. Yeah, one more point for the uh, for the uh, championship, and obviously starting pole position is the best place to go out in the race, which is what we need to do this afternoon. Uh, obviously, only five or ten percent of it. Five or ten percent of the uh, of the job is done. But um, thank you. yeah, I think uh, I think obviously it's the best place to start. Um, we knew we had a lot to come from the practice yesterday, so it's nice to go out and deliver it. And uh, we'll see what happens this afternoon. But um, very happy, the car feels good, so I think we've got a good chance anyway. It's very exciting to get this through, obviously, with the first major championship come back for a while. Um, what are your thoughts on this track? Yeah, I really like it, it suits our car really well. And, um, it's going to be really interesting this afternoon. I think uh, the track is going to play a massive part in the race. Um, I think the team that manages that, manages that the best will, uh, will, will come out on top. So I think, I'm sure, we've got the biggest car, but we need, we need to focus on that a lot. Hopefully we'll get the right results at the end, but um, like I say, I really enjoy the circuits and being you know, quite tight just to really suits the design tech car. Um, I think it was like that last time, which is probably why we uh, didn't, didn't have a particularly great race, so hopefully we can, uh, we can um, have a good one this afternoon. Harry, thank you for struggling on there, and thank you for your thoughts on that. Congratulations to you and your team. I will turn to our LMGTE, uh, Paul versus Paul, the number 85 golf race in the UK, Aston Martin, Manchester 8. The birthday boy is Stuart Paul, who celebrates his birthday yesterday, so a great result to you, and a great result to the team at the end of the season. Yeah, don't remind me. <laughs> uh, it's fantastic. Um, you know, it's just a testimony to, uh, to the whole, whole, whole crew of golf racing. You know, we've been working extremely hard all year. We haven't had the best of luck, and uh, it's nice for it to all to come together qualifying this weekend. Uh, we've got a long race ahead of us, but uh, it's the best way to start. Obviously we talked earlier about the, uh, do you think your car suits this circuit? Was there a bit BOP break or is there a guy that's been working really hard on the car to get set up? I think it's a, it's, it's a number of things. You know, the guys have been working really hard all year. Um, we had a, a good BOP in air in Red Boring a few rounds ago and that got changed for the Boring car. And Red Bull and Darby, we were nowhere. Uh, we were, were massively up to that line of speed. And we'd be given the Red Bull with BOP back for this weekend, and suddenly we're, we're back sort of fighting for the top few positions again. So you know, I think it's a combination of things, but BOP does help. Uh, the guys are working really hard. Uh, we did a test there earlier on in the year. Um, and I think you know, the Aston's a quick car. Uh, you, you see that around the world at the moment. Um, so, yes, yeah, a combination of things, but uh, very pleased to be here. And you say you've got three, three Ferraris, including the two contraption titles, and within a tenth of a second. It's going to be a tight start for race stuff, maybe? Oh, we don't care about it. You know, we're, you know, it's less real, we're fighting for our race. Um, we want to go out and get the win. Who cares who's around us? You know, they're just going you know, to say, you know, we're going to fight as hard as ever. It could be a championship contender or not. You know, we're going out there to, to fight and try and get a podium position because we want to go out this year, you know, swinging and, and fighting hard. Good sentiment. Thanks, man. Thanks. Good result for you and good result for golf racing. And in, and in our GCC, uh, Paul was here for the third time this year. Uh, the number 71 SMP Ferrari 458 Italia GT3. That's all it. Luca Persiani, Luca, congratulations. A great result for the team. Um, very close though, um, at the top with the four different manufacturers. It's quite interesting, GTC, isn't it? Yeah, it's great. It's uh, I think it's great for, this, uh, for, the, for the show. And uh, our car suits this track. I think our car suits a lot of tracks. And uh, here they are closer, uh, due also to the, the difficult condition today, I think. Because uh, it was a little bit dampy in the sun court. And we decided to wait a little bit, five minutes, and to try to start to drive at 10 minutes to go and stop after two laps. And it was a risky decision because they were getting closer and closer, but in the end uh, we got the pole, so I'm so happy and proud of my team because the car was just perfect. Thanks. On this afternoon, SMP racing a fighting for the team title in GTC. Your teammates are back down in. Uh, I think the world of eighth place at the moment. Is there anything you can do to help your teammates or is it just going to run your own race? 
sure we will help. Sure. My job to 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 make everything uh, to to help SAP to I work for them. So uh, and it's important. The most important thing for us is to let SAP win. So we will be in the race. Of course, we will do our race, but we will be uh, ready if they need to win the race, and we can still win. My car we can still can still win the championship, or just stay and not just feel so. Uh, and your thoughts on this Estoril circuit after the finale here? I think it's uh, great when you come to drive in this historical circuit. It gave me a different uh, feel, different power. I. When I was little, I was watching this, the races of Formula One, this track, and for me, it's special to drive here. So it started to give me something more. Fantastic, Luca. Are there any questions from the floor? No, we've got a short turn. Thank you, Mr. We're going to run across about three drivers that we'll do it. We'll see you on the half past one of the races.